the Jordan Michael Tuesday show and we'll try and make this episode kind of really quick because my assistant today is again Grandma Michael Tuesday. Uh, Grandma, how'd you get in without the alarm going off? Okay, never mind. Fix it later. My assistant today is Grandma. Wrong! Uh, oh, it's not? <laughs> Well, why are you? You seem to be standing right there. Who, who's the assistant today? It's cowgirl Chris. Oh, Hi, God. friends. What you doing? I am just so excited to be on this show today. Uh, Grandma, that's a puppet. I'm not talking to a puppet. So oh, I'm... please, Doctor Me. No, I'm sorry. I can't because you're not. Uh, no, Grandma, so I'm not. <sighs> Grandma, I can't. Hey, I got to do ventriloquism. Hi, kids. I'm cowgirl Chris, and I'm gonna go ride a horse. Amazing. You are? Hey, y'all want to know something crazy? Y'all thought it was her the whole time? It was really <coughs> me. Okay, well, let me let me tell you our verse for today, and we'll get through this. She says, uh, our verse for today... Our verse for today... Comes out of... Comes out of... The, the Bible. The Bible. Grandma, please! Don't yell at your grandma! Yeah! All right, sorry, Grandma. I didn't mean to yell at you. He said sorry and please. Oh, well, that's good. He's a nice boy. Just a little irritable. Uh, yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, our verse for today is Proverbs 25, 17. And it says, Let your foot <laughs> let rarely be in your neighbor's <laughs> house. Let your foot rarely be in your neighbor's <laughs> house, or he will become weary of you <laughs> and, and hate <laughs> you. <laughs> hmm. That reminds me of Gary. Hey guys, I'm Gary. I'm your new neighbor. Here's a picture of myself. I thought you'd like to get to know me. Now it's a good time for me to come into your house. Is that all right? Well, now's really not a good time. No, it's a great time for me though. I really do need to... Hey! <laughs> good to see me. I, I thought I smelled breakfast. A lot of people don't like eggs and hash browns. I like them. I like them a lot. Who is in there? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's been almost two hours. Oh, well, you guys have some good books in How'd there. How'd you get in here anyway? Ah, uh, the door was open. That's a rude question. Good night. Love your neighbor. So what's our plans for Thanksgiving? We are going to visit our relatives in Buffalo. Oh. Well, I'll have to check with flight, Scott. So I might have to sit this one out. But I'll try to make it work. Hey, hey. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just borrowing uh, your well, everything. Is that a problem? You forget the gas for the mower. Oh, the gas can, the gas can, thanks. Nice throw. Intercepted! <laughs> just got it. Gary, we're trying to have a little father-son time here. Do you think you yeah. could give us a little bit of space? Oh, I'll just... Father son time. Okay. Yeah, I, I can dig that. I'll, I'll, here, I'll just uh, I'll go over to my property. Get him good, Forrest! Gary! My property line's right here. I'm not on your property. Have your father son time. I don't care. I don't even care. Strike, perfect pitch. He's got the makings of a of a pitcher, Dad. Face mask, face mask. <laughs> Careful on that face mask. You guys got in real in real leagues they would call that a face mask. You know, one time I was I was playing baseball when I was a kid, just like his age, and I remember I tried to dive for a ball. And when I dove for it, I remember all this grass got up my nose. And I was pulling grass out of my nose for three weeks. For sale by owner. Oh no. <laughs> Didn't like the house, huh? When are we moving? You know, sometimes we can feel rejected when people don't want us around all the time. But respecting people's no is very important for having strong relationships. Most of the time when we respect people's boundaries, it makes them more excited to be with us because they don't feel like we're going to run them over. And that's it for this week. I'm what? Sure. What is wrong? Can I see it? No, no, Grandma. I talk to real people. The puppet can't say anything. You, Please. You're... Go ahead. What's the matter, girl? You got laryngitis? She's shy. She wants me to say it. Of course. We'll see you next week on the Jordan Michael Tuesday Show. Oh, we made it. You need to be brave.
Thanks for watching the Jordan Michael Tuesday show this week. Be sure and subscribe if you haven't yet and leave a comment. Tell me what you thought of uh, today's vlog. Bracken is a friend of mine. He's got this awesome vlog called Tiny Notes from Home and it's a family vlog that I think you'd really enjoy. Tell, tell a little bit about that. Actually today we shot a vlog for our channel and so be sure to come on over and check out the behind the scenes of this video. We do a video every Monday just to encourage families to spend time together doing meaningful things. If you do them every Monday, is it okay if we come over on Monday and be uh, in it? Well, I mean, yeah, I mean... Well, we're already in it, but can we be in a couple of them? Like, more than one? Yeah. I mean, uh, I just, you no, know, I mean, maybe today is just enough. No, I mean, no, seriously, I can see this working. That We do a show every single day. Oh, starring wow. me that's a lot in your show and and every day I just say something funny, I'm not like, sure uh, that I see somebody climb up a ladder I'm like hey I guess I'd have world. to think about it but oh. what, what are you guys having for dinner tonight um have you read this Bible verse no not even once <laughs>